The grid control can merge cells vertically, therefore providing a clearer data presentation for viewing with lots of repeated values. In this video, you'll learn how to enable the cell merging feature for the entire view or individual columns. You'll also see how you can change the algorithm which determines if two neighboring cells are to be merged. Let's start with the grid control displaying data in the usual format. At design time, access the View's properties, then expand Options View and enable the Allow Cell Merge option. As the grid provides no default UI for cell merging, create a button handler that would toggle that same option at runtime. Now run the application and notice that column cells that have the same value are merged. Click the button to see how the layout changes when cell merging is enabled or disabled. Note that you can enable a more readable view by sorting columns that have repeated values. This puts identical values next to each other and thus the view joins bigger chunks of data into merged cells. Now select the priority column to access its properties. Expand options column and then disable the allow merge option. Run the application to see that priority cells aren't merged anymore while the feature is still enabled for other columns. Now you can notice that email addresses in the created by column have repeated domains. You can change the cell merging algorithm so that all cells with the same domain are merged together. Next, select the grid view and access its event to write a custom column display text handler. The code checks if the create by column is being processed. Cell display text or email address is obtained from the display text parameter. The handler then retrieves the substring with domain name and assigns it back to display text. And let's run the application. You'll see that domain names are displayed in cells, but no merging occurs since the feature still relies on cell values rather than display text. To fix this, write a cell merge event handler. First, check if the correct column is being processed, then obtain display text for the two cells being compared. Finally, indicate that cells are to be merged if their display text match. Set the handled parameter to true to override the grid's default processing for this column. Now, run the application to see that cells are being merged based on domain information. 